Hi, I'm Ryan Hamilton. I'm the Elevation Product Manager here at Digital Globe. We live in a 3D world, but all the imagery you collect, whether it be satellite, aerial UAV, it's all 2D flat imagery. We need elevation to rectify and make those images real. But elevation is used for a whole lot more than just rectifying imagery. So what is a DEM? It's a digital elevation model, a model of the Earth's terrain in digital format. A DEM is made up of gridded elevation values that, when mapped out, generate the shape of a location on the Earth's surface. DEM can be created from LiDAR, radar, or optical stereo imagery. When we talk about DEMs, they are generally classified in two ways, posting and accuracy. Generally, posting is used as the value for the name of the DEM, say a 1 meter or a 5 meter DEM, and it describes the distance between the measurements of elevation on the ground. The tighter the posting, the more detail of the terrain you're going to get. Accuracy refers to how closely the heights in the model match the actual ground heights that you're measuring. Accuracy is independent from posting, but generally the tighter the posting, the better the accuracy. Just like with imagery, terrain comes in various flavors depending on your needs. There's things like DSMs, DTMs, contours, point clouds, and 3D, but what does it all mean? Digital surface models, or DSMs, show the elevation of the ground as well as all the things on the ground, like trees, buildings, cars, you name it. Say you need to determine line of sight for cell phone signal propagation. You would want a DSM to help identify how both the terrain and the features on the terrain would impact your cell signal. For those who only need to see the bare earth, there's digital terrain models, or DTMs. A DTM shows bald earth with all that stuff that's growing, placed, or attached on the earth's surface scraped away. If you need to understand the extent of flooding or maybe calculate the amount of dirt that needs to be moved for building something, you need a DTM. Contours represent terrain with lines of the same elevation value. Contour lines are a lot like bathtub rings, except think of the terrain as the bathtub walls, and each ring is separated by an equal elevation value. When visualized together, you see the 3D shape of the terrain displayed on a 2D paper map. Point clouds are another interesting product. They're basically elevation DTM or DSM, but in a point cloud format, meaning that it's points randomly spaced like a cloud. This is important for customers that are used to ingesting LiDAR in their workflows. And 3D? Well, 3D is the imagery of the future. This is the transformation of 2D images into 3D representations. No longer do you just see the world from above, you see it from every angle, and with that, you get a lifelike view of the world. We've been offering elevation products for over a decade. With our industry-leading archive, processing speed, and resolution, we're able to produce products that beat what our competition's selling today. We want to be your one-stop shop for your geospatial needs, and our global elevation products help bring us one step closer to being that indispensable source.